we're not conscious of a lot of stuff that happens in the background. So very oftentimes people get hints and they'll solve a problem. And then later when asked how they solve the problem, they'll make up some nonsense. But it's obvious that their reasoning came from this particular hint. Like, for example, there was a room where there was two ropes like this and people, you know, the researcher would walk into the room. They're like, you have 10 minutes to solve how to tie these two things together. And in half of the experiments, as the researcher would walk, walk, walk out, he would bump one of them. So it kind of like swing a little bit back and forth. And in the other half of the experiments, they wouldn't, they would just walk out. And guess what? In the experiment where he bumped and the test subject saw it swinging, the solution, the people, th those people would tend to solve the problem, like double or quadrupled the rate of the people where that didn't happen because they they saw a hint as to the solution of the problem but then later they were asked how did you solve the problem they would come up with some bulk like oh my aunt worked as a trapeze artist in the circus like they had no idea why they solved it 